accountability. Account anyone would like to explain what accountability is? When you're committed to something, right? That's this, this. Committing and reporting. Committing, reporting. This accountability to who? Accountability to yourself, right? When it's like when you commit to do something, do it. Or don't do it. I don't believe in half way. You either do it or don't do it. It's like Yoda, you know, in Star Wars. There's no such thing as try. Either do or don't do. And part of this is that it's to do with success. I believe there are three things that are about success. It's the first one is willingness to learn, and a willingness to be uh, trainable, a willingness to coach, be coachable, a, a willingness to be open, a willingness to even get rid of your beliefs. That's all about learning, because we get stuck in our beliefs. We believe certain things. I believe nothing. Do I have beliefs? I believe, yes I do. I have beliefs. But I'm also willing to change my beliefs. There was a, a philosopher called Bertrand Russell in the last century, and, and he said something very profound which I live by, and he said this, he said, I will never die for my beliefs, because I could be wrong. <laughs> and, it's, and for me, it's a great philosophy to live by. So there's a willingness to learn. The second one is a desire to succeed. And that means changing. Because most of us, the reason you're here is not because you're here, it's because you want something different. And the question is, is how much do you want it? How much do you really want it? And the third thing is a commitment to take action. Because if you, if you have this willingness, you have a desire to change, right? Will anything change unless you take action, yes or no? No, nothing changes. Everything stays the same. And what I'm going to suggest is, is that what you're looking for is these three things in other people. But if you don't have it yourself, are you going to attract the types of people who will have the same thing? Yes or no? no. So it's important for you to have it, yes? You must have that. One of the things I'm going to ask you to do is, is that you know, during the day is that if you don't have this, then reconsider what you're doing. So that's important, that's important to me, because I, I love talking with people, and I love helping people who are prepared to help themselves. Because can you help someone who, can, who was not willing to help themselves, yes or no? No. no? no, it's impossible. You can assist them, but there's only one person who can help them, and that's who? That's them. There's only one person who can help you, and that's who? You. And I can only help you if you are open to being helped. 